Okay. They're not hostile. Which is good. You have vanquished a great evil from Skyrim. You have saved this land and our very souls. Yes, that's right. Thank you. That would be me. Right, to the house, Kajo. I'm bloody positive I've got Dragonbone there. Right, crafting time, Kajo. Check my crate here. No, it's empty. Fuck it. Ah, ha, ha, dragon bone. Not much. Oh, yeah, firewood. Okay, um. I know I've got a thing for firewood. Okay. Can I do it here? Okay. Okay, it's not much, but it's something. It gives me 47 arrows total. What else have I got for arrows? I've got Daedric arrows. They're not bad. They'll do. We're okay. Angie's camp. Come on, Kajo. Okay, turning up at the log. Wait, 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 wait. Who the hell's in the road? I think that's Angie's horse, you know. Charger, what the hell are you doing? This is it. Past the keep out sign. That's the one we want. Okay, they're going to be upset. They thought I was dead. They thought... Rigmore was dead. The dragon the dragon They're bad. Where's Rigmore? Okay, who am I talking to first? My mother, I guess. Dragonborn. We thought you dead or captured. Yeah, I can end it. Rigmore! What happened to Rigmore? Okay. This one needs something. Talk to Sigrun. Yeah, I thought it would be. What is it? She didn't make it back. Oh, no, 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 she's... I hate you. She's not dead. I hate you. D don't hate... Listen, let me finish. Matter. Oh, my God. Dialogue. She's still alive. So how do you know? She was taken prisoner by the New Order, and they need her unharmed. But why? I don't understand. Some very powerful forces are at play here. We must wait, that's all I know. Thank the God she's I could alive. elaborate more than that. I could tell her about bloody Azora. There, there. I'm the bad guy now. This one needs something. We need to talk in private, apparently. Hey, listen. What is it? Not you. Uh, I want to talk to the kid. Sorella. Sorella? No. Let her sleep. Talk to her in the morning. Okay. Barenda. Well met. As I said, some powerful forces are at play here. What is it? There is an entity that seeks to enter the realm of mortals. Who told you this? Um, Azora herself. Do we know who this entity is? Um, it hasn't revealed itself yet, but it cannot enter until... Mm -hmm. Until a new order has been established in Tamriel. So it all becomes clear. Khajiit brought Sigun here because he thought it would be safe. But now, nowhere is safe. What is going on? I was told to pass on this evidence, Barendar. This one would never have believed it. 
Tamriel surely is in grave danger. Khajiit will need to travel to Cyrodiil right away with these documents. Okay. So you will need to stay here and protect the girls until my return. Sure. Oh God. He can stand up pretty bloody fast, can't he? Say goodbye to Bar Rendar. Well met. Travel safely, old friend. Take care of them, Dragonborn. If they find us here. I give you my word I will protect them with my life. You bloody right, I will. Let's hope it doesn't come to that. And the gods favor us well. I swear by the gods I will find Rigmore and bring her home. For their sakes. Khajiit hopes you do. Talk to Sigund. Khajiit got your back. Guessing she's still in here, is she? Sigund. Well met. How is she? She's asleep. Don't worry, she'll be fine. Okay, ask Sigund about... What, have I got night vision? Nope. No, no, it's just bright. Yeah, sorry, but I'd be looking at a mum, <laughs> not her. Um, Sigan. What is it? And you, how are you? Okay, I guess. It's just weird, you know. After all this time, we're finally reunited. And now she's gone again. It's like a curse. She was such a good little girl, very bright. She wanted to be a teacher one day, then a singer the next. She sings pretty nicely, I actually. I recognized her, you know, at the prison. I feel guilty about that. How could I do such a well, thing? Well, you haven't seen her for a long time. Don't be hard on yourself. It's been some time since you last saw her. I remember when she was about seven, Ragnar made her a doll. It was just doweling for arms and legs with a sackcloth dress and string hair. But her face lit up with the biggest smile. She wouldn't go anywhere without yeah. it. Yeah. She would rough and tumble with the boys and fight in the snow. He would throw snowballs at the guards until they chased them off. Sounds like fun. One day the doll went missing. One of the boys told her the new dark elf girl had stolen it. I took Rigmore to their house, and the girl's father apologized and gave back the doll. Rigmore saw the little girl was hiding behind her father, crying. She handed the doll to the little dark elf girl and said, why don't you keep it? And ran home. Hmm. Ragnar made her another one, and the girls became inseparable. That is a beautiful story. These memories kept me alive. I knew that while there was a chance she was too, there would come a day when we would be together again. Sometimes I wanted to just give up, get it over with, and see my beloved Ragnar again. But I would always see that little girl playing, or trying on dresses, chasing the boys. When they came for us, I tried to hold on to her. She was crying. They wrenched her away from me and she kicked and screamed and I couldn't do anything. I tried to reassure her. I told her everything would be alright, to go with them. I wanted to die. Oh, yeah, I can understand it. It must have been terrible for both of you, though. Barbin explained to me how he rescued her. I am forever in his debt. Well... She's a fighter. Her father taught her well, and that's what saved her life. But she didn't deserve this, Dragonborn. She deserved a normal, happy life. Little girls grow up to be mothers and daughters. The gods have cursed our family. They've stolen and corrupted her innocence. How can she ever have a normal life now? I don't think she really had any choice in the matter. As long as they need her alive, that gives us hope, right? It does. I promised her I would never let her go, and I am sworn to find her. You must be so tired. I will find her, Sigurd, even if I must ride into hell itself to bring her home. Why don't you rest a while? Grab some sleep, use Rigmore's bed. Which one's Rigmore's bed? I don't know. I don't know where the bed is. Is it? Well, this one's free. 10 p.m. Let's get eight hours in. Dragonborn, wake up! Oh, 
I wake up faster than that. Elsewhere is an arid land of deserts and rocky canyons. Where the sun shines warmly. Yes? What's wrong? It's Sorella. She's missing. Angie has gone to look for her. One of her bows is missing. We think she might have gone to try and find Rigmore. Oh, crap. You stay in case she returns. I'll catch her. Angie up. Cirilla, okay. Catch up Angie. Where is she? Whoa! Okay. Get a horse. I haven't got time to faff about. Am I going the right way here? No, nope. they've gone up the hill. Come on, Kaju. Bloody changed into crap armor again. Zorilla. Angie. Zorilla. Need something? Any luck? She can't have gone far. Look for any fresh just of snow on tracks. Okay. She went this way. Come on. What? Are we going on horseback or? We're going on horses. Down here? Okay, we're down. Okay, let's check it out. I'll follow your elevator. Can you sneak? You know. No? What is it with these people? Blood like throne? Okay, not good. Oh, yeah, there's a thing. I'm hearing what oh gargoyles. Huh? I knew it. You got him. Not jumping out. Bar from the other side. I seem to remember that. Someone is digging. What's been going on here? Who is this? Where's the girl? Vampires, eh? You see, it's the flesh. It keeps us young. You do understand, don't you? What kind of vile abomination are you? Your worst nightmare. Really? Here's yours. See? Like that. Okay, kill all the vampires, save the girl. Okay. That we can do. Oh, wow, well, they have been busy. I don't remember quite this much being in here. But yeah. Oh, it's a Khajiit. I thought... <laughs> thought she was in there. Okay. Come on, vampires. Where are you? Yeah. And you, gargoyle. Go. 
Ooh. We'll take those two. Oh, that better not be. It's too big. Ooh. Yeah, vampires. Hello, vampires. Nothing new here. I thought we'd got rid of these guys in Skyrim. Oh, it's not a note. Nope, it's a bony hand. Find that rope. Being careful. We're feeding on little children. Yeah, you do. What happens when Dawnbreaker gets going? Oh, this one's a tough car show. My god, he's tough. Why am I hitting him with a spork? armor was he wearing? Not even that good. Oh. Does my sword need charging? I thought I'd done all that. Yes it does. That'll be why. Because it kills vampires better. Is that magic? Careful, please. Okay. What is this? Your end. They just sat there like a couple of lemons. to Surat what oh she was there and we didn't oh god I, I got all wrapped up in you know hacking vampires to pieces sorry Sorella whoa hey, watch okay the wolves they won't hurt me they're... I've seen something like this before I knew you would come I me. slightly killed the wolves sorry
My bad. Right, talk to Angie. Yeah? Take Sorella home. There's some business I need to take care of. Okay, be careful. Uh, yeah. Kill the master defiler. Oops, I think I did. Ah, vampire's note. To the master of Bloodlet Throne, word is your coven has been discovered by a vengeful red god. Be wary of strangers and keep the wolves loose. They will at least warn you of any impending danger. Do not underestimate this woman. A mother of one the lost brought to our table. She has on her person a cursed bow, a ring of protection. Do not touch these items. The ring will cause any vampire who wears it to descend into madness. The bow is fused with the bones and ash of our brothers and sisters. To touch it brings death. We are now many. Sex are beginning to flourish in all of Tamriel. I don't need to impress on you the importance of maintaining our secrecy in our activities. Sethius. Sethius? What? Find out what's been going on. They've been eating people. I thought Sethius was one of us. He was one of the good guys. Ah, vampire hunters. Xena's drink. Fortifies marksmanship and protects children against vampiric calling in nightmares. Zena's Wraith. Burns the target for 20 po- What? 400 and- Silver arrow? Okay, he was kitted out for this then. Well and truly. Wolves have been eating money again. Okay, I think we've got to read that journal. They come and invade our children's dreams. In a stupor of nightmares, they disappear into the night. Hammerfell has cried rivers of tears for the, for the lost. One day you wake up and find they are gone. This happened to Xena. I have made it my life's work to search in the hope I might find her and hunt down those mon these monsters. The vampiric defiler, be uh, the defilers believe the flesh of the little ones will bring them youth. I will bring them death. My bow will burn them and cleanse their evil souls in the hellfire. And my silver arrows will drive into their black hearts. Xena's wrath shall never rest until the very last demon is wrought but a pile of ash. I ring to keep them out of my dreams and protect me from their sorcery. Finding her necklace will let me know. Until I find it, I cannot rest. And so I continue the hunt. I have tracked them down to their lair, the Bloodlet Throne. Here is the coven of witch devils infesting Hammerfell. Here is where they flee to bloody their lips and gorge on the innocent. Here is where they meet their death and forever burn in the flames of oblivion. I have found their place of abomination, their table. I am close to their resting place. I can feel it in my bones. Once the job is done and I have found you, we will be reunited. Not long now, Xena. Not long now, my love. Take Xena's wrath and Xena's ring. Destroy the lair. Okay. Gotta wear the ring as well, I guess.
I. Very good at I, but any idea where? Ah-ha! Everybody sneak. Is it just me and you, Kajo? Okay. Then we can probably do this... ...my way. This way, nothing. Ah, oh. a pantry of sorts. this before. But it wasn't these guys in there. No, I didn't need kill cam. Good, did it, buddy? So, what did they do? Summon her in her dreams? I'm gonna have to give her this to protect her. Bloody, yeah, I remember he had a thing about boots. Zena's golden necklace. What does it do? Nothing, but it does something. What is it? Return Zena's necklace. Well, I will once I'm sure I've killed every single vampire thing in here. Then I'll do that. Okay, and this was their grand dining room. Sorry, I hate missing people missing out. This feels awfully familiar, you know, Kaja. Don't touch anything on the table that you're thinking of eating. Very bad idea. 
The one with a return? Is that it? We killed them all. Whoa! struggling, aren't you, Kajo? Okay, so what do we go back out the way we came? coming in here and it being very similar in a pit full of dead bodies but they weren't summoning and eating children there was a particular vampire in here we got rid of so I guess these guys moved in after the fact <sighs> nothing I can do for any of them Burn the bodies, I suppose. Kajit got your back. Mommy! Do I do? Oh, he's got it back. Okay. Keep the bow, we'll need them later. So, it was just the necklace I needed to return? Is that what it said? Return the necklace, I have done so. All this talk of dragons returning to the world makes me more than a little nervous. Now what? Head back to Angie's, okay. Let's hope nothing else happened while we were down here. All the horses are still here. Now this storm is just not going to clear, is it? I suppose it is the winter. Okay. Sigun. Yes. How is Sorella? It's all right. I think this is a little odd, but I will when I see it. Missed. Really? Now a dragon? Where are you? The bloody thing. Oh. Um. You know what? Let's go with what we know. And uh, yeah, I think. Um, Seeing as I have so many. Come on, where are you? Where are you, dragon? <laughs> Missed him. Son of a... Come on.
That stung you, didn't it? Yeah, it's okay. It's kind of what I do. Ah. Dragon bow. Kind of needed some. How Sorella, apart from being traumatized by a ruddy great dragon. Angie is with her. The little girl is still terrified, poor thing. I'd better talk to her, make sure she's okay. She saw those people get murdered, Dragonborn. They told her they were keeping her for a special feast. She says she keeps hearing voices, terrible voices inside her head. Ah. I should unwear that ring. And give it to uh, to her. The roads of Skyrim lead to many dangers. It may be dead now, but where did it come from? The sky. Sorella, how are you feeling? Yes, I think so. I'm sorry. I just wanted to find Rick more. I know you did, but everything is going to be okay. Will they come to hurt me? No one is going to hurt you. Not from there anytime soon. I won't run away again. I promise. And I promise to find Rigmore and bring her home, okay? Okay. Can we talk a little bit about what just happened back there? Mm-hmm. Why didn't the wolves hurt you in the pit? Do you know why? I don't know. But I just knew they wouldn't. The bad guys said they were hungry and pushed me into there. Then the bad guys got all angry at the wolves because it wouldn't hurt me. And they got all angry at the bad guys. So I knew I was safe. Then you and Angie came for me. Yeah, I want you to put this on. Okay. It'll make scary voices in your dreams go away. Don't ever take it off, okay? Kajo, I think we might be up. Why are they each other? Bloody hurt my horse, I will hurt you. We'll be fighting. Damn it. The hell was that guy? Nova the Tracker. They weren't kidding. Careful with that fire. Angie, this is not good. There's only one of them. I bet I could take him out from here with my bow. Uh, I think you'll be needing this bow. Oh, not hold on to me for it. It's for Sorella. Sure. Oh well. Defend Angie's camp. Right, she's now got that Daedric bow. A word of advice, my and we probably got company coming. Taken together, they will empty Is it daytime? Not for long. There was only one guy. What's that over there? Well, the Thalmor. Oh, come on. We 
did just run into a target range, you do realise that. And the Dragonborn. Any more? I think we got just about all of them though. Stood in a nice little thing. Thalmor no no love you even less, Karja. Thalmor officer. Oh, look. He had orders. Rigmar wanted poster. No, that wasn't what he had. Ah, there we go. Adrius orders. Captain, new order, security squad. It has come to my attention that the accursed Rigmore and a guardian were given a safe haven at some worthless hunters, huntress camp, huntresses camp south of Falkreath. Now the guardian is dead and Rigmore in captivity, we need to eliminate any loose ends. Take a tracker and a detachment of my troops and find this camp and burn it to the ground. Execute anyone you find there. Leave no stone unturned. You're going to be okay now. Need something? Just to know you're going to be all right. And yes. Okay, she's going to be okay. She's got the the protection ring on. If anyone sneaks up on us, you'll I block the way, Carjo. Yes, I know. Okay. Speak to Sethry. Where the hell is Sethry? Okay, I'm kind of confused. I've got. Take the bow and ring and the silver arrows, you'll need them later, but that's from the last stage. Speak to Sethry. Oh, I can't, I don't know where he is. I don't have a marker for him. He's not hiding in this chair place. So I don't know where to find him. Stood down there. Sethry. Thief, messenger, disciple and mage. Don't tell me all will be revealed, Not yeah? All. Some, yes. Some will be revealed. Do you know where Rigmore is? Not exactly, but I know a man who does. Continue the conversation. Okay, Sethry, where is she? She's being kept at the same location as the portal gate. My goddess cannot sense its location. There is a powerful force blocking her insight. But she can sense Rigmore is there and safe at the moment. But there's something else. They're looking for something. Azura doesn't know what, but whatever it is, it has something to do with that massive excavation site in Markarth. And this man who knows, what of him? Does the name Jonty Malasam ring a bell? Little bit, he was yeah. working at the forge at Diamond Ridge. Apparently got cold feet when the New Order desecrated Azura's shrine. Filthy dogs. So he legged it, and he's now in hiding. Okay. He won't spill the beans to me, though. He says he'll only speak to you. Why me, though? He doesn't actually know me. Are you for real? You're the talk of every Stormcloak and Empire camp in Skyrim. Wonder why that is? Stormblade and Varon were holed up before the High Council of Tamriel for a game of arse slap. Because all night drinking parties were held in yours and Rigmore's name. Everyone assumes you're dead, including the New Order. But you don't roll through Diamond Ridge without getting noticed. 
They're so rattled, they even sent people to mop up a huntress and some orphan kid out here in the arse end of the world. The bodies lying out there in their own blood are testament to that. But Malasan, he knows you're alive. Don't ask me how, but he knows where the portal gate is. Find that dragonborn, and you'll find Rigmore. Okay. Okay, where can I find this guy? On this map. It's all very secret. You'll be needing to convince your newfound family to find greener pastures if I were you. There's bent to be more. Now they know where you are. Yeah, true. Speak with Sethry Persist. Well met. What do you suggest? We have nowhere to go. As it happens, I've got an old place you can stay. It's a bit derelict, but with a bit of work you could get it in ship shape in no time. Just outside Rifton. That kid probably hasn't even seen a summer, or a proper tree, or a spring flower, or even another kid. Ever thought about that one? Plus it's safe. Stormcloak territory. No Empire or Thalmor to worry about. I'll mark it on your map. Okay. What about Bardar? Barden Ra? Leave that old Khajiit to me. Thank you, Sethry. I don't know what to say. It's vital you get these people to safety, Dragonborn, before you meet Malasan. Once they're established safely at the old farm, go and see the Alpha. Okay. I'm counting on you to get Rigmore out of there alive. Farewell, Dragonborn. Until next time. Homestead Farm key added. Confiding Sigmund about leaving the mountains. Okay. So he was actually just hiding down there all the time instead of up here. But he's here in secret, so it does kind of make sense. But he's difficult to spot in a grey robe in a bloody snowstorm at night. <laughs>